Hey everybody, how are you doing today? What's going on? I hope it's all good. So, I wanted to just talk briefly about the power of being mentioned, the power of having your name mentioned. It's such a nice thing. I just came from, i uh, been having some car problems, and I just came from one of the shops, and I walked in, and the man says, you know, I was talking about you with some friends the other day. These are, uh, I don't know what their beliefs are, really, but they said they were having a, a Bible study. Uh, and that my name came up in the Bible study because each one of these people had met me in a different place. And they'd all met me within about a week of, you know, this incident where they got together. Uh, it was fascinating to understand that um, it's a beautiful thing to, to know that you're having an impact and for people to share that with you in such an immediate way. Um I had met uh, one guy because he worked on my transmission and I met another couple of guys because there was a place where I could go and get like raw uh, juice, you know, vegetable juice because uh, I do try to take care of myself every now and again. I have to balance out uh, some of my chocolates and other things with vegetable juice. So... Uh, was really amazing that when I went to see about the transmission today, because I have a little problem with it, that the man said this to me. He said, yeah, we were <clears throat> thinking about you and talking about you, and we were wondering what your opinion would be on this verse. You know, he didn't tell me what verse, but they were studying a certain passage. And he said, man, we would really love to know what you think. Um, and I just thought, wow, you know, that's really beautiful to realize that, A, I'm out there, I'm making a difference, I'm, I'm, you know, if you know me, you know that that's not really difficult for me to meet people and talk to them. But you don't really know, and I didn't really know, how much of an impression I had made uh, they said that they uh, really wanted to know what I thought about some things and that they wanted to get together to talk about it if possible. I gave the man my email and I said, you know, if you have questions, you can email me anytime. And we went from there. How does that relate to each of you watching and listening? It's like something that Rav said, you know, you're going out there, you're making an impact, you're talking to people, you're smiling, you're doing good things, you're just saying hello, you're being nice, be kind. It's the most important thing, kindness. And you know, just these little interactions, you're filling up with fuel for the car, uh, you're getting a snack in the grocery store. You're, you know, you're dropping your kids off at the bus stop or at school and you say hello to someone or you're kind to someone. These things are so powerful. We cannot lose sight of it. And, you know, I know that even when I, I'm having a day that's not great or like today when I'm having some difficulties with my car, you know, I still want to be able to tap into that place that can help other people. Maybe I'm going to do something to make their day a little brighter, a little happier. You know, I'm going to say a, a quick joke or something. And it was a little bit of a joke when they were telling me like, yeah, we want to, we, when this guy comes in and he's like the only guy we know who wears funny strings on his clothes. Uh, but we want to know what he thinks about this verse in the Bible. So, you never know, guys. You you have to 
take whatever powers you have and use them to help people. Use them to make people's day brighter. If you're a writer, then write things. If you enjoy meeting people, then go out and meet people. If, you, if you're if you sitting in a coffee shop and you're uh, doing something on your computer, sending emails, or you're on Facebook or whatever you're doing, then do that and use it to make people's day brighter and stronger and more powerful. And the most important thing that I want for each of us today and for you listening and watching and hearing my voice, I want you to know that Hashem is always mentioning your name. Hashem is always mentioning my name. And I need to remind myself that, and you need to remind yourself that, because just like when I went into this place and they said, hey, we were thinking about you, we were talking about you, and we were thinking good things and talking about you and wanting to know what you thought about this thing. Man, it's powerful to feel that. And how much more, Kol Vechomer, how much more, when we know, when we feel, when we believe, Hashem is mentioning our name. When we walk in and Hashem says, Man, Hashem, 